Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is your host, Ellie. Hey yo. I actually took care of myself today and for the first time in a month, I feel equipped and able to sit down and edit this vlog for y'all. It has been turbulent as it comes with newly graduated friends. Adulting versus college, very, very different. Here are a few clips from the last month, I think. And I hope you enjoy. I don't know, the coherency might be questionable, but we'll see. And stay tuned for more vlogs coming your way very, very soon. Happy Friday. We're gonna do an unboxing. This is what we got, the Godox. Oh, yeah, it comes with a case, that's good. Goes all the way back, all the way forward, it turns. So that's awesome. Oh, that's what this is. Each household could get two free coke tests. Actually, last week was a, was a hard week, and so I did some retail therapy. This is an oversized sweatshirt. It just has this like detail up here-ish. And they're great because down at the bottom, they're a little flared from afar do they look cute i can't tell we're gonna do a horizontal haul just in case it's saint patrick's day on thursday and i actually have plans like corporate horoscopes which i don't really love the sound of that and then from there after that meeting we're going to like go do top golf for saint patrick's day and like have food and drink and have fun and get to know each other, which I am excited for. And I have no idea how bright this is. So you and I will experience this together. Oh dear. Because where else would I be? We out here on the Target um, run for literally no purpose at all. These for my bathroom. Look how pretty. I want a new one of these, so I'm getting this one. Should I get this one or should I get Tranquility? or serenity i think i'm vibing with the clarity one honestly it's the most like chill oh, yeah thank you for shopping with us today the health of you your families and our team members is our highest priority so when i looked over earlier really cute guy walked by, looked over, giggled, we made eye contact, and then kept walking. And I just was like, okay, cool. I have, I just got this one, which I love, because, you know, social media manager, that is me. <sighs> oh man, what a time to be alive. A woman at Watermark, she is, she would mentor me, maybe. I would be so excited. I would be so excited to work with this woman. Here's the problem with social media is that like, people kind of put other humans, even though we're all on the same playing field, put them on like kind of a pedestal and i'm guilty of it like i had to sit there and be like ellie she is a human and so are you period t you know i don't have any way to embarrass myself literally if other words come out of my mouth besides hey nice to meet you i'm ellie then great we can have a conversation but if all that comes out is that i've introduced myself and i was bold in this moment and we're back hi okay so it's about two weeks after that, maybe three, three weeks after that, which is about average response time for my church because it's massive. Um, but this is so cool and you can see the joy in me right now. I am geeking out, I'm geeking out. Not just because of like the, the clout of meeting with this person and doing the ministry thing, no. No. <sighs> okay, one of the women that I look up to 
who I found at the top of this year when I was kind of in like a, I want to make some money moves. I want to pursue making Bible studies and putting them out as content. I want to be bold in my faith. And in that way, I love being bold in my faith in the way of writing and producing and publishing Bible studies. That's how I feel like I'm being bold in my faith. And it's approachable because Bible studies are for, if you write them the right way, are approachable to anyone. So, 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 so dope to not even write, not just write the content for Bible study, but like write and then design and then publish something that is like describing how much love and grace and forgiveness God has for us to be published for the world to see in hopes that they may understand God's love. I'm sweating. I'm that. Mm. Oh. So I was just geeking out because I'm like, it's starting to come together. And then I was like, oh, I should vlog about it because I haven't really vlogged a whole lot with you guys, um, which I'm sorry, but um, a lot's been going on. I just had my meeting and it was so good. How affirming too. Oh, that's like, I'm like not good enough for that. And she was literally like, I would love to recommend you for this surf team. And I was like, wait, me? Wait, what? Wait, you think I, what? Huh? And I'm like, oh my gosh. I just... Ah, the Lord is so good. Oh, you missed most of my facial expressions. That's so sad. Here's some Jesus content if you haven't heard from the Bible today. Psalm 35, verse 1. Oppose my opponents, Lord. Fight those who fight me. Take your shields, large and small, and come to my aid. Draw the spear and javelin against my pursuers and assure me I am your deliverance. Let those who intend to take my life be disgraced and humiliated. Let those who plan to harm me be turned back and ashamed. Let them be like chaff in the wind with the angel of the Lord driving them away. Let their way be dark and slippery with the angel of the Lord pursuing them. They hid their net for me without cause. They dug a pit for me without cause. Let ruin come on them unexpectedly and let the net of, that he hid ensnare him and let him fall into it to his ruin. Then I will rejoice in the Lord. I will delight in his deliverance. All of my bones will say, Lord, who is like you? Recu rescue, rescuing, rescuing the poor from one who is too strong for him. The poor or the needy from one who robs him. Malicious witnesses come forward. They question me about things I do not know. They repay me evil for good, making me desolate. Yet when they were sick, my clothing was sackcloth. I humbled myself with fasting. My prayer was genuine. I went about mourning as if for my friend or brother. I was bowed down with grief like one mourning for a mother. But when I stumbled, they gathered in glee. They gathered against me. Assailants I did not know tore at me and did not stop. With godless mockery, they gnashed their teeth at me. Lord, how long will you look on? Rescue me from my from their wrath. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Rescue me from their ravages. Rescue my precious life from the young lions. I will praise you in the great assembly. I will exalt you among many people. Do not let my deceitful enemies rejoice over me. Do not let those who hate me without cause wink at me maliciously. For they do not speak in friendly ways, but contrive fraudulent schemes against those who live peacefully in the land. They open their mouths wide against me and say, ha ha, we saw it. You saw it, Lord. Do not be silent. Do not be far from me. Wake up and rise to my defense, to my cause, my Lord, my God. Vindicate me, Lord, my God, in keeping with your righteousness. Do not let them rejoice over me. Do not let them say in their hearts, ha, just what we wanted. Do not let them say we have swallowed him up. Let those who rejoice at my misfortune be disgraced and humiliated. Let those who exalt themselves over me be clothed with shame and reproach. Let those who Want my vindication, shout for joy and be glad. Let them continually say, the Lord be exalted. He takes pleasure in his servant's well-being. And my tongue will be, will proclaim your righteousness, your praise all day long. 
why did that hit so different and why did I almost cry? Oh, yeah. I think it's fun to share my life online and I'm going to continue to do so in a variety of ways and I'm excited. Maybe if you've already noticed a little bit on Instagram, you know, you know. Um, I'm going to save that story for another, another day.